Two years later, Mrs. Doria was talking to a man about her strange experience with a phantom hitchhiker. He knew immediately where she was talking about. He remembered the story of the young boy who was picked up on Highway 20 back in 1936. Now to our next ghost tale. It takes us to the town of Sand Springs. It involves the high school and the ghost of the green light. Since I came here in 1977, we've had a lot of strange occurrences in the auditorium. And the auditorium has been somewhere that everyone has felt like was haunted. It started as, they said, a green light that was in the balcony that would move across the balcony. And um, there was a light that burned in the balcony even when the lights went out. There used to be a light over in this area over here, and it burned for a couple of years. Even if you turned all the lights of the auditorium off, that light stayed on. Uh, died during the construction of the auditorium here and there's been stories that it's you know possibly him um, but there's been other voices heard I mean there's been no one's ever been able to distinguish the words I and mean, it's always something that seems universal that when you hear these conversations that you hear it and they sound very argumentative like someone's wanting you to leave their space uh, but you know and then when you come down to where the voices are they're gone We've had things like Sonitrol, the alarm system here, uh, called us one time and told us that there were voices in the auditorium that were so loud at night that they uh, could not monitor the rest of the high school and had to turn the monitor in the auditorium off. Uh, we saw a light move across the stage last week. I saw it just kind of out of the corner of my eye, but one of the other boys in class kind of jumped because he was looking straight at the stage. And I said, you just saw that too, didn't you? And we saw a light of some kind just kind of pass. I think the funniest thing that ever happened to me I, uh, was when we had lights flickering in this back hallway back here, and I had a class going on. Everyone saw it, and the lights would dim down and flicker, and then they would come back up. And I finally, just in de desperation, because it's kind of ruined the class, asked them, would you please, if you're there, leave the lights alone. I'm trying to have a class, and the lights came up and never flickered ever again after that. So that's kind of what happens down here.